Welcome to Studio Biology. In this video, we are going to discuss the various modifications of leaves. First of all, we'll take the leaf tendrils. Leaf may entirely involved in formation of tendrils or a part of leaf may also form a tendril. So, depending upon the leaf or its parts, the tendrils may be of following types. For example, first one is whole leaf tendrils. The examples of whole leaf tendrils are wild pea, that is Lathyrus afeca. In Lathyrus afeca, stipules become fallacious for photosynthesis. As the leaf is completely modified to a tendril, so photosynthesis is done by the stipules which become leaf-like or foliaceous. The second category is leaflet tendrils. Leaflet tendrils include Pisum sativum. It is also known as garden pea and also Lathyrus odoratus. Which is known as sweet pea is involved in formation of leaflet tendrils. Now next type, petiolar tendrils, that is petiole is modified to form tendrils. The examples include tropiolum magus. also known as garden nestertium nepenthes also is having also known as garden Nestertium Nepenthes is also having the petiolar dendrils. Now, next type is Rachis and petiolule tendrils. What is petiolule? Petiolule is basically the stalk of leaflet. And such tendrils are observed in clematis. So we can observe that Clematis here wretches and these are modifications of the basis of leaflets that is petiolule. Now the next one is leaf tip tendrils. That is leaf tip is modified to form tendrils. The example include Gloriosa superba that is also known as glory lily. So we can observe that 
here is the leaf tip tendril that is tip of the leaf is modified to form tendril now the next type is stipular tendrils stipular tendrils include the examples of smilax the stipule is modified to form tendrils so these are stipular tendrils in addition rachis tip tendrils can also be observed and the examples will be lens culnearis and the examples include lens culinaris that is lentil so these are the leaf tendrils now the second type of modifications of leaf is leaf spines in leaf spines leaf or any part of leaf is modified to form spine to reduce the rate of transpiration it also helps it also gives or provides protection to the plant against grazing so there are two benefits of modification of leaves into spines first one is transpiration rate is reduced and another is protection is provided against grazing we can observe the barberry and cactus in which spines are there the examples include barberry and another is cactus in barberry and cactus whole leaf is modified to spine while in some other examples like aloe or solanum solanum xanthocarpum a part of leaf becomes a spine so this was the modification of leaf into spines the third modification is leaflet hooks in this type of modification leaflets of a compound leaf are modified to three clawed hook like structure for clinging we can easily observe this structure three clawed just the claw of cat so the example include 
Dolly Kendra, Anguis, Catty, which means that Cat Claw Creeper. So the leaflets are modified to hook like structures or claws like structures. So this is the third type of modification of leaves. Now the fourth one. Fourth one is phyllodes. Phyllodes are also known as phyllodia. Now what are phyllodes? Phyllodes are basically flattened petiole or wretches of a leaf which performs the function of photosynthesis. We should also know that formation of phyllode is a mechanism to reduce the rate of transpiration. It's very important. It reduces the rate of transpiration. How it reduces? There are two basic factors behind this. First one is that phyllode is vertically placed. So exposure is minimum. And next one is that it has fewer stomata in comparison to leaves, typical leaves. So the rate of transpiration is highly reduced. Now, examples. Examples include several species of acacia. For example, acacia longifolia. In acacia longifolia, petiole and a part of wretches is modified to become phyllode. Other examples in this category are Parkinsonia aculeata. In Parkinsonia aculeata, the branches of wretches that is Rachilla or secondary wretches, these are modified to become phyllode. So these are phyllodes and their examples.